Hey guys, it's Joel here, aka Galax, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is my Christmas wish list. Now, a guy called Sam Hume left a comment yesterday saying, Why don't you do a Christmas wish list if money wasn't an object? I don't actually get that many presents for Christmas. I usually get a bit of money off my mum and my stepdad to go towards something that I really want to buy. Never ask people to buy me clothes because either I usually hate them or I usually just get them myself. So I've compiled a list of things that I would love to get if I had the money and a couple of things that I already do have that I think are a great investment for Christmas. And a very exciting thing, my first ever collaboration, which goes on sale today. First things first, this shirt was not in my recent pickups video because I forgot to put it in, but I got this the other week and it's from a Korean brand called Nens Official. I'll leave a link to their store in the description below, but I'm so obsessed with it. It's like hairy, it's like oversized, it's such a good fit. I love it so much. And so many of you guys were asking on last video and on my Instagram video, of the pickups as well. So there you go. Now, the most exciting thing ever, I've been working with a brand called Maddox Studios for the past couple of months on creating my very first kind of collaboration. I've been teasing it a lot on Snapchat, so I don't know if you guys had caught on. A couple of people guessed what it is. It's not clothing, which is quite surprising, um, but it's something that I love so much and I think everyone has these at some point in their lives. I think it's also a thing you, that you appreciate when you get a little bit older as well. It's like when I was at uni, I was like, obsessed and I'm still obsessed now but it is a candle <laughs> all the candles are handmade here in London I've had a lot of meetings with the people at Maddox developing two scents uh, for two different candles for the Galax and Maddox Studios collaboration um, and here is the finished product and I'm really really proud to say that this is available online now um, I'll leave a link in the description below. Great Christmas present, great stocking filler. I'm really, really happy with this. I hope that you guys like it. Um, if it's something that you're interested in, um, check it out. There is a discount code in the description below as well that you can use when you check out to get money off your order. I really appreciate your support in this first collaboration of mine. I love Maddox as a brand. I'm really, really happy to be working with them. Their candles suit my aesthetic so much. And the scent is insane. Like. This one is Asian Amber and Ylang Ylang, and it's got my little sticker on the front as well, and it's in a black glass container. The candle wax itself is soy wax, so it's vegan, and everything in the packaging is made from recyclable materials, so the whole product is eco-friendly. And the actual candle itself is only £20, um, with the discount code as well, so you can get money off. If you guys do buy it, and you do post a picture on Instagram or on Twitter, please remember to tag me, put at Galax, um, and tag Maddox Studios as well, because they'd love to see what you guys do with these as well. Um, I hope you like them. It's kind of like a Christmas present from me to you and hopefully I can do a giveaway with a couple very soon. But yeah, I've been so excited about this for so long and I finally get to share it with you. So I'm really happy about it. Um, check it out in the description below and let me know what you think. Now, moving on to the wish list, that was like a stocking filler. And now let's move on to the big boys. Now, I've scoured the internet for things that I would absolutely die for but they're just so expensive. And what I've done as well throughout this video is link more affordable options, similar options, to each piece below. So don't come for me telling me that this video is too expensive and everything's crazy, because that's the point of it. It's supposed to be like, if money wasn't an object, what would you buy? I'm gonna start at the more affordable end of things. And when I say affordable, it's still really expensive, but these are the cheapest items on the list. The first one is a new sweater from Off-White, which I think is perfect. It's just a black plain sweater with a bit of text on the chest area and that's £279 I'll leave a link in the description below I want you to let me know what your favorite piece is out of all of these by the way the next is I would get a different colorway in my Alexander McQueen sneakers because I wear them all the time and they're so so comfy and they go with so many things I would get another colorway as well to like change things up a bit so here's two colorways that I like um, at the moment I'll leave links in the description below as well the next is <laughs> Gucci, loads and loads of Gucci stuff is insane. I love all the embroidery, hence my Zara jacket in the last video. So I would love to be able to get some Gucci sneakers, um, like these embroidered ones here. This tiger hoodie that says Blind for Love on it, I saw on Mr. Porter. Next up, we have two Gucci embroidered jackets. <laughs> I think I've lost my sense of which is more expensive or whatever, because these are like, one of these is £3,000 and the other one is £6,000. So obviously never ever gonna buy these. I don't know who would buy these. You la you leave a comment below if, you, if you've if you got the cash to buy these, but I don't know anyone that rich. <laughs> the next is a fresh pair of Common Projects. I already have a dark gray pair, but these are kind of a lighter coffee kind of color, which are really nice. I saw them on Mr. Porter. Also, when I was in Rome, I spilled ice cream on my Common Projects. So suede and ice cream don't mix very well. Uh, next up, also from Common, Common Projects, a pair of the Achilles 
these sneakers. I see loads of guys rocking these and they look awesome, so I'd love to cop a pair of these. Next up, I thought this Saint Laurent t-shirt was awesome. It's got a dinosaur on it and I just think it's really cool. Um, that's around £220. Next up, now I was thinking of copying this a few weeks ago and it is the Represent Clothing Shearling Jacket, which is insane. It just looks so good. Um, but it was £800 and I was like, not right now. <laughs> But unfortunately it's sold out, um, but I found a similar one on All Saints, which I've also shown you here, which is it's equally nice, it's a bit cheaper as well, it's around £700. Next is something that I actually just received, and I've shown these in my videos before, but I've never had this one. This is the big Steamline and Reese collaboration stowaway case. Um, Steamline have brought out a new collection of cases over on their website, um, which I'll leave a link to in the description below. And I'll leave a link where you can buy this one as well in the description below. These cases have been the most awesome thing of 2016, I think, because everyone I love them, everyone that sees it loves it, it looks sick, you, they make you feel like a proper like, I don't know what they make you feel like but I just feel really great when I'm carrying these cases around. Um, and in terms of like luxury luggage, they are kind of affordable, I know they're around 300 and something pounds but when you think of like other cases it can be like 1000 to 2000 pounds, that is in perspective a little bit more affordable. It's definitely good for like a big Christmas present or a birthday present and stuff like that. So that's why I thought I'd include it in this. Um, but I'm gonna be using this when I go to Bangkok tomorrow. If you didn't know, I'm going to Thailand tomorrow for five days um, with a bunch of mates, but it's also for work, so it's gonna be insane. Make sure you're following me along on Instagram so you can check what we get up to. And the next piece is a piece that I've seen everywhere and it's so sick. It's by Vetmont and it is a t-shirt, like oversized t-shirt, so it's made the bridges I burn light the way. But it's like 520 pounds and don't think I can bring myself to spend that on a t-shirt at the moment. So that is why it's in this thing as well. I've linked in the description below. Next up is some pieces from Yeezy season three, like this rust shearling jacket, which is insane. But again, it's like one and a half thousand pounds, which is crazy. And then the Yeezy military boot, which are 500 pounds. Always new stuff coming out. So you really have to pick and choose what you invest your money into, especially around Christmas as well. Because there's sales and stuff as well. I think people get trapped into like buying stuff that's on sale. Really give it a good hard think before investing that Christmas moolah. And I think that kind of sums it up as to like my ultimate Christmas list if money wasn't an option. Um, as you can see, the total in the corner is a ridiculous amount of money. So <laughs> I don't think I'll be getting any of that for Christmas. I'd love to hear what you think about the pieces. I'd love to hear what you think about my candle collaboration with Maddox Studios. If you did like this video, please don't forget to subscribe. It would mean an awful lot to me and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.